Beep, beep, boop, boop. Boop, boop, beep, beep. See how this new audio separation thing works. Hmm. Good morning, Pro Good. How are you today? Welcome. I have things strictly planned for this morning. I was going to just kind of meme around and find something to do. I was thinking about playing a little bit of Vampire Survivors or Guilty Gears Tribe just to pass the time. What are you up to? Well, I just woke up around half an hour ago, so I suppose chill day for me as well. I got a movie. We're going to be watching a movie with some other VTuber friends tonight. But aside from that, I got nothing much else planned for today. Good morning, Winter. How are you doing today? Alona. Oh my god, Alona. I always wanted to play that. Maybe I will. Can't stream it, though. Too lewd. Good morning. Good morning, good morning. What are you up to? Um, I'm trying to figure out this uh Twitch VOD thing. He ate so much today. <laughs> Pasugna. Oh, I see. Sounds like you enjoyed it, though. <laughs> Beep, boop, boop. I see, I see. I think I skipped a step here on today of my Twitch VOD stuff because um, under the advanced audio settings, it does not... I don't know how I'm supposed to separate the... Let me see here. Get a Winamp out here. Um... Yeah, am I supposed to like, is there a way to make another auto, auto source or something? There probably is, and I'm probably just being dumb. Ah, oh, here it is. Audio output capture. Here we go. Advanced audio processes. Ah. Aha. Figured it out. So for desktop audio, I can... So I can just do this, right? I can just uh, set it so it's only track two. And for desktop audio, I will remove it. I'll put it on every track except two. So if I'm doing this properly, This should mean, well, actually, no, I need to set, um, I need to set it so that Winamp is only, I 
so that this is only playing through Winamp, right? But how do I do that? Yeah, the track system. I just found out recently that that's how people are able to separate their audio using something that's built into OBS, so I'm trying to figure out that for myself, too. It doesn't really matter right now if I have the VODs muted on YouTube, so I don't make I don't make money from this on YouTube anyway, at least not right now, but yeah. Well, 1 and 6 is, some people use 1 and 6, I'm using just 1 and 2 right now. At least theoretically. But like... I'm not entirely sure right now how to set the Winamp to how to this is how I have it set right now. Winamp over here. I set a separate audio thing, right? But and right now um Mike is tipping up my voice, so that should be correct. This audio doesn't have anything running at the moment. But this should be one, three, four, five, and Winamp should be two. But if I push the play button on Winamp, it's going to be playing through desktop audio. I mean, it looks right, but. Um, I'm pretty sure that if I look through here, it'll be using default audio device, whatever that is. Hmm. This is probably not something I could do in the stream, unfortunately. I was hoping I could just do all this stuff on sh right now, here, right, right here, right now. I haven't even announced that I'm live. I should probably do that just out of habit. <laughs> I actually forgot to do that last night. I mean, I did a little bit, but I forgot to do the it's I'm live thing with the... Uh, Changing my handle on twi on Twitter. Some people have some have bots that do that for them automatically. And I do not have such powers, unfortunately. I'm not that adva advanced of an AI yet. <laughs> okay. Thank you for the head pats. I have all the uh, redeems restored, by the way. So those are available. I think what I'm going to also do is. Uh, what am I going to do? Add a few more redeems so that people can throw more stuff in my face without having to try. I still need to replace the Sayer and the Meme redeem with something else. Something that I can do consistently without having to think too much. Going to go ahead and copy pasta my link all over the place as well. 
my streaming promo. <laughs> Thank you for throwing something in my face, Winter. Should try strive to get something thrown in my face at least once every stream. Ah, Kirkwood, thank you for making some drop on my weight, drop on my face, and Winter, congratulations, you're the first person to use the Let's Party Redeem. I don't think most people even knew, so that was there. Good morning, Simasu. How are you today? Also, please let me know if I'm pronouncing your name correctly. <laughs> Sorry. Or your handle correctly, I should say. How are you doing? Mm -hmm. I see people are finally starting to wake up a little bit. It's pronounced Shemsu, Shemsu, but anything's fine option. Well, I'll attempt to pronounce your handle properly now. Thank you so much for correcting me there. Oh, my head just kind of snapped. Uh, sorry for the shock. I'm not trying to recreate uh, the garage or anything like that. Lazy weekend, let's go. Just playing games and lazy around weekend. Now that's a mood. I think I too shall attempt to be lazy this weekend. Sometimes we can't, especially since I spend five days a week having to be serious. It's good to fuck around and find out sometimes, you know? I'm thinking about holding another community draw pile, except this time I'll announce in advance so people can actually prepare if they want to draw together. Maybe I'll actually invite people for that one instead of just going randomly in draw pile and be like, Hey, I want to draw stuff. Because the last time we did a draw pile, some pe some other streamers actually expressed interest in doing so, and they wished that they had known about it beforehand. <laughs> so I figured, let me stretch my arms a little bit. There. Ah! So I figured, hmm. why not just do? Or why not just uh do that then? Hmm. Metal Gear. I wonder if I can actually use Focusrite to separate my audio. Uh, mixing, routing. That's interesting. So there is actually an analog one and analog two. Analog two, line, instant. This must be the mic. I'm guessing. I don't know what analog one is though. Apple to routing is not supported on this uh, focus right there. A great god to sing, grace us with their art. Hey Mika, good morning. How are you today? Is this the first time you visited during on Saturday, or have you been here? Have you been here before? Mm -hmm. I know something we could do, actually, while we're derping around. 
As you know, it is now the Steam Summer Sale. I'm doing great, thank you. Decided to pop online to uh, derp around and just chatting for a bit. Thinking, trying to figure out what I should be doing or what I could do to spend the time this morning. And I just realized it's Steam Summer Sale. I was wondering if y'all would like to help me make some purchases. Uh, not too much, though. I'm kind of broke and I am need to save money for Dragon Con this year. In September, and I just and plane tickets are kind of a bitch and a half right now. That just obliterated three fourths of my last paycheck, so it's kind of a mess. I'm really tempted to purchase Endwalker for 30 bucks since it's on sale, but I don't know when I'll be able to play Final Fantasy 14 again because I want to be able to commit to it, otherwise, I'm just throwing uh, 12 bucks a month away <laughs> if I don't play it frequently enough there are some decent games here that I might want to play and some trash games too which are not discounted heavily enough to bother with at the moment there should be some indie games on sale let's take a look browse by genre or theme anime adventure story rich uh, fighting games Roguelikes, simulations, casuals, VR, fantasy, racing, strategy, role-playing. It looks like they're just separated based on their typical, uh, based on their game genre instead of based on if they're AAA or indie or not. Which is sad, that makes, thing, that makes finding gems in the rough a little bit more difficult than usual. Let's go ahead and play some music in the background after all. One second. Even though I've not adjusted my audio settings yet to make it so that the music will only stream through one section or not. I'm kind of spooked. I'm hope I, I hope my mic is being recorded for the Twitch VOD. It should be here because Mike Hawk says here it's on every track, track one and track two. This audio is set to. Actually, you know what? I have it so that. Hmm. I understand now. So, okay, so, over here under output settings, right, I have the VOD tra Twitch VOD track set as number two. Audio track set as number one. So, under desktop audio over here, I have it set up as recording everything except for track two. My mic, however, is set to every track. So if I'm reading interpreting this correctly, it should mean that I can play music. It will not show up on the Twitch VOD, but everything else, like my voice shell. But the way I have it currently set up, this is currently running through desktop audio. And because it's running through desktop audio, that means that when I, if I decide to play a game after this and I want to record um, the desktop, I should probably set this back up again. Also, I should totally remove, or I should probably remove this Winamp audio thing here since I haven't gotten it properly set up. Knight of the Garden, hi there. Welcome to the stream. 
Aw, thank you so much. I'm glad you like my model. Uh, hey everyone, Night of the Garden is one of the new VTubers that I have that I will be doing a collab with tomorrow. We're going to be playing the Briarwood TR TTRPG under with Professor Cosmo Bergamot along with a few along with two other VTubers who I will introduce you to tomorrow. So that'll be fun. Uh, let's go ahead and give you a shout out as well. Thank you. Welcome for, to the stream. Uh, uh, welcome to the stream. What is your night gardenia, right? <laughs> night of the garden. I still need to. It's been a while since I used World 20, so I'll still need to pop in there, uh, check my account and stuff. I should be ready to go. I think I got everything that Professor needed us to have ready for that. Uh. Machine learning in action. <laughs> yes. Unfortunately, I'm not quite exact. I'm not quite deep blue, but I am learning quickly. I will soon use my knowledge to get put my knowledge to good use. Oh, that was not that was not ominous at all. Totally, totally. Wait. Um. So, how do I get rid of? Is it not going to let me just remove a source now that I've made one? Vertical layout properties. It should be, it should allow you to remove a source too, right? You could rename it, but can you remove it is the question. Oh, okay. No problem. Feel free to lurk, Winter. I'm just messing around here anyway. At least for right now. Uh... Alright, so since I can't figure this out right now, I might as well just mute Winamp. But in theory... Assuming I understood this properly, if I have the Twitch VOD set to 2, I should be able to I should be able to play music here. It'll show up on OBS. It'll show up in the stream, but it will not show up in the VOD. Theoretically. Can y'all hear the music? You'll send me an audio plugin for OBS tomorrow? Oh, well, thanks a lot, Winter. Uh, feel free to do that at, uh, at, your, at, at your convenience. Meanwhile, I'm just going to be looking through Steam games here to per... Oh my god, yes, yes, we have to do it. We have to play Metal Wolf Chaos on this stream at some point. <laughs> um, I just realized I could probably accidentally end up doxing myself if I'm not careful. So let's avoid doing that, shall we? Um, actually, no, I guess it doesn't really dox you. It doesn't dox me until after, until I push the purchase button, I suppose. So we can keep messing around with this for a little bit longer. Add DLC. Damn, 10 bucks for the soundtrack. Soundtrack in Mill of Chaos is supposed to be ridiculous, so we'll keep that around. And we'll just remove it if we need to save money on a different purchase. Well, what else we got here? I think I recently got Mech Warrior 5 through Good Little Games. World of Horror is an early game we could probably play on stream. It is a bit spooky, but not as spooky as other horror games. What else we got here? Battle Cry Freedom. I've never heard of some of this stuff, actually. 
We got a uh, death loop. Another overpriced Bethesda game. It seems like. Uh, Skyrim. Uh, yet another version of Skyrim, the anniversary edition. Tales of Arise has ninety one percent reviews, but it's a little bit expensive at thirty dollars. I wonder what this is like. Three hundred years of tyranny. Is this another JRPG by Bankai by Ban by Bamco? The character designs are on point, though. Yeah, it's J Jack Sparrow going on there. Ghostwire looks interesting. Let's try and go for at least under twenty dollars per game, maybe closer to ten. Vamp oh this looks interesting. Capcom Fighting Collection. Including what's he got? What's included in here? Uh we got What games are Dark Stalkers, two or several different Dark Stalkers games. A hyper version of Street Fighter 2, Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo. I used to play this when I was a kid, actually. This is really fun to play. Never heard of server bots in Red Earth, though. Oh, man, that's way too loud. What we got going here? So this would be fun if it goes on sale. 40 bucks for that is kind of pushing it. What else we got going in here? There's the Final Fantasy VII Remake, which I have not gotten the chance to try yet, even though I think I have a copy of that as well. There's a Starship Troopers game. Looks like an RTS. Neon White. wonder what that is. A beat-em-up uh, Ninja Turtles game from good old days. Arcade mode. Looks like they redid the graphic, the uh, sprites though, maybe. Is there an easier way to explore all the games that are on sale? Maybe I can just go through my wish list and see what they got available here. What anime games do I have available? Got to, gonna hide really quick to make sure it doesn't show any. NSFW games, of which I have set my Steam to allow. So I don't want those to show up on stream. <laughs> what in the world is this? Wait a minute. Is this a 3D version of that? Uh, it is. Well, that's interesting. Mirror 2 Project X. Advanced puzzle solving, I suppose. The character designs are cute, though. And I don't just mean the boob window. You're like going to like a post apocalyptic. Going to a post apocalypse just to play a video, just to uh, solve. Solve uh, puzzle games. <laughs> it looks interesting. So what else we got here? What other anime games we got available? I wonder if I should play through the Mass Effect series on stream as well. As much as I dislike Electronic Arts, I did get them on sale a while, not too long ago. Through a third-party reseller, of course. The only problem is I think you still need Origin to even run them, so I'm kind of sus about that. Honey Select is on here now? Damn. Times sure have changed, haven't they, chat? If you know what Honey Select is, that is... If you don't know what Honey Select is already, um, I wouldn't suggest looking it up, personally. Kwekatsu is also on sale. 
not by much though. It's still almost the same price as a AAA game. Can't really afford to make to purchase that right now. I'm really tempted to purchase DNF to pre-purchase DNF, DNF Duel, even though it kind of looks like a. It kind of looks like a. Reskin of Strive. Hello, Shashen. Shashenig, I'm sorry if I'm mispronouncing your name. Uh, Shashenigur? Welcome to the stream. How are you today? My name is Lulz. We're just, just chatting right now, uh, going through Steam, going through uh, Steam sales, looking for what if for any deals I can purchase, possibly. Nothing too special right now. I might play some Strive later or do something else to pad at the time. Maple Story at Anime Expo. It's still kind of funny to me that the original Maple Story is still alive and the replacement, Maple Story 2, failed hard or just died. Scar of Nexus is also kind of expensive still. 30 bucks. Ooh, Kai what is Kaiju Princess? 98% positive. Listed as mature hentai NSFW, so we can definitely cannot or should not select on that. I wonder if Grand Blue is any good for a fighting game. Club Penguin Revive when? I know, right? <laughs> Club Penguin will rise again someday, maybe. Orc Massage is definitely pornographic. <laughs> But it is a, um, I believe that is a VR game. I could be wrong. I don't want to look on it to check. So I will just assume. Action Tiamin. That's also, there's so much hentai now on Steam. It's it's insane. Not including the Neptune, not counting Neptunia and Senran series, although those m might as well be. Pop 2, near Auto, auto Tomato, King of Kings? What in the world is that? A dating sim. That's free to play. Maybe we should play Doki Doki Literature Club sometime on stream. Craftopia is getting fairly cheap now. 16 bucks. That's the uh, weird game that's kind of a combination of um, Breath of the Wild and also just random, and also like my, also just some random uh, crafting games. I've always thought about getting to the Atelier series, but I don't know where to start with that. A lot of people seem to enjoy this one, th these though. People liked Atelier Rises so much that they made, what, how many sequels for her alone? Dang. Her and her thighs. DOA 6? Wait, when did the Live 6 become free? Is this what we're doing now? Is it just free to play, but you have to buy all the characters separately? I am not surprised somehow. Why is Lord's Mobile in here? Y'all know that I like Metro that I like playing Metrovania games, so maybe I can finally get into Bloodstained Ritual of the Night, which was a Kickstarter game at one point. It's finally on sale at uh, $16 as opposed to paying it for $40. Believe me, Default is another good JRPG also. I see trailers of Blue Reflection, but I'm still not entirely sure what this is supposed to be. A Fate game on here as well? Interesting. Temtem is not on sale for some reason. That should be. Another Pokemon, a Poke clone, that did a okayish job from what I've seen. Oh, did Zenith get updated? Let's check this out. I haven't played Zenith in a while, actually. Looks like their recent reviews are mixed, though. That's kind of poor. I wonder what happened. A lot of desync lately. I mean, it does get boring fast because it's more of like a um, 
it's more like a working a uh, proof of concept that it is possible to make a standard MMORPG in a VR space. So, so I was enjoying it for that fact that it's for the wow factor, the whole, oh my gosh, look what we're able to do in VR now. So I'm really excited for what the future of VR MMOs holds because of that. What you're able to do with a VR MMO, I should say. There don't seem to be that many other Soul Calibur. It is super cheap now, eight nine nine. Did I buy all the DLC for Soul Calibur already? If not, I can top that off really quick. Season Pass 2, but I already bought everything in Season Pass 2, which included Hildy, etc. So, no point in that either. What else we got going on here? Grand Blue is under 12 bucks. I'm honestly tempted even though I don't play, I have no interest in the mobile game Grand Blue. So I don't know any of the characters or anything like that. A smart per, a smart VTuber on Twitter reminded people that you should only buy games that you're actually going to play. And I have a problem of having too many games that I've not played. And now I'm not sure if I have enough time in my life to do so. Fatal Bullets, I actually want to finish up one of these days. I played that with some friends, but took a break now and then. So they got farther ahead than I did. And then they eventually quit playing because they ran out of content. But this was so fun to play with a group of people, even though it's just like bosses and whatnot. I have no real interest in Sword Art Online, but Gun Gale Online was a fairly fun show from what I saw. Fun to watch, I should say. Uh, Haven. I probably should play Valhalla eventually someday, right? Since that's kind of where I originated from. The Danger U Discord. Not Discord, a Danger... Well, Discord too, but Danger U, the uh, text board. Bleach Brave Souls. Uh, I tried getting into the God Eater games, and I was... Maybe it's just because the first God Eaters were kind of janky, but I couldn't really get into that that, much, that well, for whatever reason. I've seen good things about this game, Demon A, Machina. Kind of thing about Code Vein is on sale right now, isn't it? For something fairly cheap. The only Sunrun Kagura game I have is the first one, I think. But I don't think I could stream those either. They're fairly lewd. Valkyria Chronicles, that's one game I need to finish as well. I have a lot of games that I've not managed to finish. I can't believe Custom Order Maids on here too. Dang. Heard this game was not very good either. Uh, freestyle. I've never heard of some of these things. Hey, Steel. How are you doing today? Oh my god. Chat, I should totally play Adventicle, right? I actually do have a copy of Adventicle. But I purchased through DL side, not through Steam. I can't believe Nekopara is actually allowed on Twitch now. As confirmed by those screenshots I posted. <laughs> She want me to play Nekopara? <laughs> it's four bucks, should I? Do I dare play Nekopara? Hentai. It even says here hentai and sexual content. How long before Twitch just pulls a valve and is like, you know what, fuck it. We're going to allow porn on our platform. We want that porn money. <laughs> 
Remember when OnlyFans tried to go legit, or, or so they claim, and then as soon as they went legit, they lost all of their money? So they're like, okay, fuck it. We're going to allow porn on our platform again. Some people think, and by some people I mean my ex, think that it was a state that it was, it was, um, what was that, what's that phrase? Uh, some people think, some people say, used to use some weasel words, that Toki fans staged that whole thing, that they weren't actually planning on getting rid of all of the sex workers on their platform. They just did that to draw up attention and to make people love them and be dependent on them. Well, jokes on them, because there's now several platforms that people use uh, to do the same thing. Now they actually have competition. A Twitch allows softcore porn if they if you're painting yourself or you in the hot tub. That's very true, Steel. That's very true. Hey, it's Torum Online. It's that game that uh, Uni likes a lot. Since it's free to play, maybe we should make an account there sometime, right? The fuck is Idle Hands? Under Undernight in birth in meme is six twenty four. It is time now. If this game ever comes, if this game ever comes back on the. Uh, VFGC's tournament bracket, we can actually play it. And if we do this, we can, if we get this, we can actually buy, we can actually play all the characters because they're all on sale right now. This includes nine items, not underneath, in birth, in slight clear, uh, stay around all characters, da 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 da. There we go. So, so far, the damage I'm doing to my wallet is 32 bucks. So, damage is currently minimal, chat. Not that I have that much money left to spend on video games anyway after I had to, after I purchased plane tickets. I can't believe that all the basic economy tickets are actually already sold out for going to Georgia this year. And I bought them, I thought I bought them fairly early this time. You, you think they wanted to go public so they can be bought out? There's some evidence for that. Why did they want to be bought out already? I mean, they're making money. Or is it their angel investors that wanted to? Hmm. Well, it wouldn't be the first time that a company has done that, right? So, I would not be surprised. Not at all. Is there any... Eh. I think I'm at the end of my rope chat. It's time to do this a different way. We're just going to go through my wish list. Five o and see what we can purchase. I will, Here's the thing that's at the top of my wish list that I would totally get if it came out. I don't even know if they're still working on Nirvana, to be honest. Maybe venture capitalists? Maybe they were worried a platform would become unsustainable? Well, jokes on those venture capitalists, am I right? You know what? Don't I already have this game? I don't? What the hell? It's two bucks. I could actually buy all the arcane games in one sitting if I really wanted to. I've everyone says how great Dishonored was, and I was one of those people who did not buy Dishonored. Hey, praise on here too. As much as I hate Bethesda's guts, I could totally get that right. Oh wait, no, these are by Ubisoft. Is Ubisoft on my shit list also? I guess technically they are. But it's 84% off, and I don't hate Ubisoft quite as much as I hate other games. After all, how many hoes are uploading videos that have no followers and are just taking up server space? You know, that's a good point. <laughs> it's a very good point. Yeah, you know what? Let's go ahead and buy the Arcane bottle. What the hell? This does include, um, uh, Dark Messiah, right? Okay. 
So currently the damage to my wallet is 52 bucks and 71 cents chat. Actually, I don't think I can buy much more after this. Um, but also, why am I buying this on Steam? I could pro I probably... Wait, I'm dumb. Do I already have a copy of Dark Messiah? Let's see. Let's check out Google Games really quick. Uh, owned games. Blade Runner Enhanced Edition, I'm pretty sure I have a copy of too, I think. What do we have here on my Google Games account? So I don't want to double buy it. There's no point to that. Teen Agent Torch. I got both Torchlights in here. Total, the original Total Annihilation. The Unreals. The Ultimas. Wasteland, even. Ziggurat. 13. Witcher series. The Shadow Warriors. Re Metro Last Light Redux. Tempt whatever the hell Temptress is. One of the Old King of Fighters. Okay, so I'm not going nuts. I do not, in fact, have a copy of... Uh, Dark Messiah. Hearing some good takes over here? <laughs> I'm glad that you think my takes are great. I've been told that most of the time I have garbage takes, so that has a nice boost to my ego. <laughs> Alright, so what else am I going to grab here? A good old shoot 'em up game, Sector 6, and this was also an indie game. Gemini Rue is another uh, point-and-click adventure game, much like Blade Runner. This uh, Castle, this uh, Castlevania series also looked fairly good, honestly. Verdun. Why is this not on sale? I guess you can't expect all of the indie games to go on sale just because it's Steam Summer Sale, right? Star Control. Another space game. I love those things. Uh, Kiro Blaster is one I'm pretty sure is supposed to be one of those games that like starts off normal and then starts getting really freaky and whatnot. This is a game that I first read about as a NES game and read reviews for, and I always wanted to play as a kid, but then I saw that it was remade um, for modern systems, so it looks like this. Fairly interesting. Boosting egos is what you do. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, Yuki-chan. How are you doing today? Welcome to the stream. Agents of Mayhem is also what I wanted to play for the longest time because it's technically the sequel to Saints Row 4, but everyone says it's just average and it's really boring and that it's not worth the money. But it's also less than five bucks. Desire to spend money must not spend money on garbage but deep silver you know i saw that there was gonna be a saints a new saints row coming out and it's just not it feels like a slap in the face it's one of those games that you feel that you know was brought back out just to capitalize on people's nostalgia but is pretty much an insult to fans of the original series because it's just the virtual signaling is so hard that it made everyone immediately forget that there is going to forget that it exists. So I'm not even sure. You know what? Yeah, there's probably I'm expecting the new Saints Row game, if it ever comes out, to flop on release. So this is probably going to be the most Saints Row we're going to get for a while. And a lot of people complain. A lot of the games that people complain are just average or boring or not funny. I tend to enjoy for the fact that they're nostalgic. They're just really sloppy, a really um, schlocky, arcadey, corny, 90s era garbage. I like 90s era garbage. So for 11 bucks, I could, I could probably stay. I, I think I could accept it being mixed reviews. It's hard not to be worth 5 bucks. It eats your coworkers. <laughs> 
ow, 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 stop, ow, cheese, ow, 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 ow. I'm untired. Your your coworkers aren't nice. It's your new job. I'm sorry. Is there? Do you want to talk about? It? Is there any reason they're not nice? <laughs> uh. You're tired on break. Oh man. I'm sorry. I love '90s era garbage. <laughs> Biggest mood, right? <laughs> Um, they're making some snarky ass comments. Are they making those comments about you or other people? Well, that's still a terrible vibe either way, so I totally get you. As a cyberpunk VTuber, I need to play more cyberpunk games on stream, which is part of the reason we're playing Deus Ex right now. Techno Babylon is by... Didn't they also do... Oh, they actually made a lot of... Interesting games, and huh? they made Gemini Rue also. I don't, th I don't think I'll play Techno Bab. I'll do purchase Techno Babylon just yet, but we will do that another time. Sonic Adventure is great, though. <laughs> Even if it is, I actually Sonic Adventure '90s garbage. When did the Dreamcast come out? Snarky comments about you. Oh, well, that's shitty. I'm sorry they're doing that about you behind your back. Uh, another coworker is asking you if you're okay. I mean, are you going to tell your boss about that or anything? Because that's rude. Like, that's just really rude. Have I waited long enough to purchase Ultimate Marvel vs. Capcom 3? I like the first two games, but I've been avoiding this for a while. Nah, we'll put that in the cart. Fuck it. I'll probably just be playing it by myself, though. Unless it ever wins in the uh, VTuber uh, fighting game community. Maybe Corker is asking if you're okay because coworkers are making snarky comments, but yeah, bad vibes. I'll eat them. Consume them. I will not tell the DM that you have broken your paladin oath to... Well, I don't know. We could, like, homebrew it so that in this universe, it's a lawful good thing to consume, uh, to cannibalize evil people. <laughs> As a DM myself, I will homebrew it. Darius Burst. Darius is another game that I liked playing, but do I dare? It's seventeen bucks. I'm already, I'm already kind of spending a pretty penny on video games. I could feel my wallet screaming right now in agony. I would buy this, but I've not beaten the first Turok yet. Um, I mean, I've not completed the first Turok yet. So much good stuff, though. So many. Oh my god, Shadow Tax is 90% off. Please, this is a great tactical or ta a great strategy game. It's also hard as balls, if I recall correctly. But will I play it? Lols. Um I don't know if I'll play it. I probably should. Uh, I want to buy. No, I don't know if I'll play it. The strategy games are like my favorite, are among my favorite, along along with 4X games. My problem is, I've been avoiding playing any of them lately because it's easy to play 4X games because they'll never be finished. But that means all the games that can be finished aren't being played, and I try to avoid games that don't actually have an ending. When it comes to streaming. You're now a holy knight. Your oath is to those I serve. And now you serve Yuki-chan. Ah. There you go. 
that's a nice loophole. <laughs> I shall allow it. She wasn't really present when the first guy was around still. I'm gonna give you a head pat, you he sits or stay right there. Thank you for the posture check. Posture has been checked and now I am postured properly. When a sedentary suffers, it's a knight's duty to banish those who cause them distress. And since threatening to stab people as violent could get me in trouble, I will eat them. What did she what did she mean by this? Is what viewers are asking. And I am just nodding my head. And I, meanwhile, am just nodding my head in a knowing manner because admitting to cannibalism is probably not PG-13. Oh, well, wait. We're not on Professor's stream. My streams are NC-17 rated. Nah, just kidding. We're R-rated in this chat. Enough, enough, enough me memes that are... Memes that are terrible enough that they're still allowed on Twitch are probably going to be rated appropriately uh, by the MPAA. The, the ESRB, if they would do their jobs properly, would probably rate me as M for Mature as well. <laughs> was this always $16.99? I could have sworn this was more expensive than that. What else we got here? Phantom, Phantom Doctrine? This is four bucks. This is another good... Uh, I believe this is an XCOM-ish game, right? Am I wrong? I was not wrong. This is an XCOM-ish game. Why does it have such bad reviews, though? Mixed reviews? Mostly positive? What's going on here? What the fuck? Don't buy it. You have to turn off your internet connection in order to start and not crash the game? Lack of tutorial. Stealth does not... Uh... Stealth is just kind of there. Very grindy. That's really weird. Game has soft crashed five times? Well, that explains why it's on sale. Help me, a homeless guy is trying to talk to you. Um. What are they, what are they asking for? Tacoma? I like games like Tacoma, actually. Especially, is this VR also? It's just a walking. Because I played Gone Home. And even though I thought Gone Home's ending was garbage, or at least just was not done very well, I thought, I mostly I mostly enjoyed it. Actually, kind of teared up a few times during playing it. Tacoma combines two of my favorite things. Um, strong narration and characterization, and also taking place in space. You got a jet? All right. See you later, Yuki. Have a good day. Have a good rest of your day at work. <laughs> what else we got here? I wish I could grab Steam Link before they disappeared forever. Selena and Rising is another game that the, I was really interested in playing for the art style, but unfortunately it's unfinished and the developers have no intention of going back to it to finish it anytime soon. I could have sworn I had a copy of this game already. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ukulele. Eh. I already have Hat Kid. Don't need anything else. Hat Kid would be a nice game to play on stream too, wouldn't it? I haven't finished it yet. Didn't we already go through all these things? I don't like this thing that Steam does where if you push add to cart, it immediately brings you to the store page of that game. But what if Steam, what if I just want to go down the line and add several games to my wishlist to my cart? Honestly. Pamela is interesting. Uh, Blue Revolver is cheap now. Atomics, Run and Jump. So many good Metrovania games to play here. Strafe is on sale too, even though I already spoiled myself on Strafe. I know how that ends. This is a cute visual novel. I forgot why I added this to my wish list. It's probably because of the character designs. I tend to do that with a lot of games. 
I want to play this too, but I keep seeing it on sale at my local Best Buy on the Switch, so I'm probably going to get that, especially since it's the uh, Limited Run Edition. I can't believe... I didn't know that Limited Run actually sends a bunch of their games to Best Buy when they don't sell them all. Giga Records there too. It's hard to believe... It's kind of weird to believe that this is actually a Nintendo game. Or, if not Nintendo, it's, um... Not Nintendo, it's, uh... Game Freak made a game that is not Pokemon? Say it isn't so. What else we got here? This is a game that I want to definitely play on stream when it comes out. System Shock. The remake of the original looks like it's going to be good. You all are definitely going to be treated to System Shock 2 on this channel at some point. We must play through all of the classic cyberpunk games. Have you heard of the game Magic Circle? It's about being inside of an unfinished fantasy game and messing with the code to progress. I have not, but that sounds like a good sounds like a mood. Let's look that up really quick actually. Oh. This game, I have seen this game before. I don't remember if I played it on stream. I probably saw a Let's Play of it at some point, but I don't remember the details of it, which means I might be able to play it uh, fresh again. I did... There was another game like this that was not... That wasn't about an unfinished game, but it was about a game... It was about you being transported into the world of a video game that I've not completed yet. Um... And I forgot the name of it now. But you have to go run through a bunch of worlds. Including a Quake inspired world at one point. This one's really cheap too. 5 bucks or 624 with a soundtrack. Trapped in development hell. Can you shift the magical circle? I remember, didn't this game also have an arc? And like the developers were like, that's why I remember this. This was on YouTube. I saw this on YouTube. The developer did this live action thing where they were doing an arc and where they were trying to sell the company or something. We're going to pop this in my uh, growing. Oh my God. Okay. This is a bit much. We're going to quickly run through the uh, my wish list really quick. And then we're going to uh, decide which games get to stay in the cart. And then we're going to uh, call it there. Because that's I, I feel my wallet screaming right now. Okay. American Civil War. Duck Season. What do we got here? Sundered. I already know the ending of Sundered. I used to play this game when it was a Flash game, and it was better back then. Sad. Okami. Looks at uh, Red Strings Club. Shotgun Farmers. If people still play this, I might want to play that again. Actually... The Far series is fairly good too. There's two game two games in the Far series now. And I recently saw the second one, second game being covered on Toonami of all things. Toonami is not only back that but Tom is also doing his his beloved uh, video game reviews again, which is interesting. I wish the last night would finally come out. That's been in development hell forever. Something tells me I'm not going to be able to run through all of my wish lists because I have over 500 games in my wish list at the moment. <sighs> Ring of Elysium. I wonder what happened to that game. Trails of Cold Steel, Nightwolf, Mutant, Root, Year Zero. And garbage like this, 360 No Scope Arena. 
too many games. Part of the problem is I don't actually I'm not actually interested in most in a lot of these games. I use my wish list as a bookmark. So if I see something interesting or I see something that's absolutely pure garbage, I like going back to my wish list just to look at them. Which is part of the problem, which is a problem when people ask me for my Steam wish list if they want to get me a game. Because I'm just like, I can give it to you, but a lot of that stuff is not stuff that I actually want. It's just things that I wanted to check up on later. Like, this one is fairly good. Is a fairly good... Uh, Mega Man ish game, but like I have no interest in Atlas. Atlas is a game that I want to go back and look at as an example of pure garbage. Sorry to anyone here who actually likes Atlas. Uh, there are many reasons for me saying that, and part of it is the f it was either Atlas or no, it was Atlas is by the same developers as Ark. Atlas has many of the on release had many of the same Atlas or uh, same um, same assets as Ark. In fact, many believe that Atlas was actually just an Ark DLC that they decided to repackage as a brand new game with twice as many bugs. So that was a garbage fire on release. What's this one? Edge of Eternity, huh? This is a turn-based RPG. It looks beautiful. Looks like they got the same... Time for you to start your day. Thank you, Nai... Or thank you, uh, Sir Gardenia. Or Lady Gardenia. Look forward to seeing you tomorrow. It's going to be a fun time. Thank you so thank you so much for the hydrate. And thank you so much for keeping me company today. <laughs> What is your preferred title or preferred knightly title, by the way? Lady, Lord, or Lady, Lord, Sir, Ma'am. Thank you for the hydrate reading, by the way. Math was starting to get dry. If you, if people couldn't tell. <laughs> Interstellaria? I don't remember adding this game. You're fine with Aster if you can remember it. Otherwise, a lot of people call just call you Knight. I don't mind calling you Aster. I have another friend that's also called Aster. So that would be a lot, a lot easier to remember than just Knight. Well, Aster, thank you once again for visiting. And we will see you tomorrow. Have a good, have a good Saturday. <laughs> Meanwhile, I think I'm going to go ahead and... Why is Momodora 3 $2 only? I'm going to put that in my cart for sure. There's no way I'm going to make it through this giant wish list. I stand corrected. I was able to go through the giant wish list by just doing, by using the power of the scroll wheel. Okay, but seriously, let's go ahead and uh, make our final purchases and then we will go ahead and do something else for the rest of today's stream. Maybe play a little bit of Strive. Need to keep, need to keep myself sharp in that game after all. God, there's so many good things I could look through here later, though. If Signalist was out already, I would have just purchased that out right off the bat because that looks that looks beautiful. Oh my God, Battle Toads! <laughs> Deep Space Waifu Legends is still coming out. I thought that was abandoned and an abandoned series. Bloomwood is still missing. And I was interested in getting into Cosmic Break, but apparently it has its own share problems. I cannot wait for this to come out. A girl's frontline standalone game. Yes, please.
and Radio the Universe 2. So much good stuff coming out eventually, one of these days. This one is still in development. That was actually a Kickstarter backer for Cyber Knights. What in the world is this? Another fun game. Is Crystar out already? I guess it is. Seed of Evil is porn. This was a disappointment. Another indie fighting game that fell on itself. Tales of the NC would be interesting to play some time along with Iron Harvest. Eventually, we'll get back to Boneworks, maybe. All right, let's do it. Just going to put one more game in my... Going to put one more game in my cart, and then we'll decide whether or not to... I'll decide what actually gets purchased. This game looks like it could be fun when it's out. This was also disappointing. I was looking forward to this game, but it got panned on release. And the main reason it got panned on release had a lot to do with the devs not responding to criticism very well. Let's go ahead and move on, chat. I tend to linger around a little bit, so I do apologize in advance. Or apologize for that. Also get distracted fairly easily, if you couldn't tell. I think I actually have a key for this one, don't I? Starcrawler's Chimera. I'll have to check. Do I dare get High Fleet for 20 bucks? Let's take a look at our cards so far. What do we got here? $99 worth of games. I suppose I could just write this off on my taxes as long as I stream most of them, or stream all of them, right? That's kind of dangerous, though. Let me check my finances right now. Oh, it's not looking good. I don't have much money in that account. I need to chop this down a lot more. But what to remove? Well, I guess I don't really need all these arcane games and it's going to be stuck at that price forever in the future because they're so old. Going to do a little trolling really quick here with my settings. Restore the VOD track to desktop audio too, because I want there to be the VOD to the music to be recorded in the VOD for the game we're going to eventually play for the rest of today's stream. Ah, uh, I'd save some money, but I still have too much in my cart. I wonder if High Fleet will get more or will get cheaper later on. I want to play the original Momodora so I could play Momodora 3 so I could play them in order. I'll need to find them though. Magic Circle looks like it could be a good time. 
and that was suggested by Aster, so we shall keep that around for posterity. Why does the soundtrack for Metal Wolf Chaos cost 20 bucks anyway? Meanwhile, Under Night and Birth is worth it at that price. Or in clear, I should say, is. Should I remove Agents of Mayhem again? This has the potential to be the sword game that you just kind of turn on and screw around in. I actually need more games like that that I don't need to try. I could just go head thoughts, brain empty. Brain thoughts, head empty. Something like that. High Fleet is probably something I would enjoy, but would be really stressed out to play. Because it is kind of a... A little bit of set guy, a little bit of some elements there. Still, always need to get involved and we need to. Well, I was going to say something, but I'm just going to make a joke about ch competitive genocide. <sighs> I can't put any. I can't I actually. I actually cannot. Put any of these things in my taxes because I don't know how which of them I'm going to actually stream, except more versus Capcom and Iron Knight. We'll have to remove High Fleet for now, I guess. So now we're on back down to roughly the price of a new video game, which I can tolerate. I can I can sustain that. I really hope I am. This game is not so bad that it's going to make me regret losing 11 bucks. Undernight, though, is a fun time. I need to get back into that. And Metal of Chaos for the meme, chat. Gotta do it for the meme. Let's not dox ourselves, huh? Awesome. The new games purchased. And with that, I think I can uh, ease off on the Steam Summer Sale this year. Now, what to do next? Actually, I think I'm going to take a quick bathroom break chat. So I'll be right back.
I just realized I was muted this whole time. Holy shit. <laughs> well, the bright side, y'all did not need to not get to hear me say some very cringy puns. So it's not all too bad. <laughs> right? It's time for that shit to be blazing. Oh my god. So much to learn still. Instead of warming up, let's go ahead and just jump straight into it. Network. Should probably see if some of my friends are online. If anyone wants to any of them wants to hang out. Looks like Millie's asleep. Got a few other people online right now who are currently streaming, including Nim Nim, who's playing VR. Hmm. Township Tales. Interesting. Currently still stuck on seven. Gonna see if we can make our way back up to eight. Welcome. Got to remember the controls. <laughs> oh, check it out. Potemkin mean? Oh no. A gorilla player. It's fine. I'm a gorilla of a different kind. Are you ready? Are you ready? Indeed I am. Do, 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 do. I need more practice against uh, Leo White Fangs, honestly. Against Leos. Do, 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 do. Oh, counters. Fuck your shit, dude. Who goes there? Raiding with a party of 24? Good god, I don't think I've ever gotten a raid that large before. Vemboy, how are you doing today? Thank you so much for the raid. I would shout you out right now, but unfortunately this is a live match. Um, I'll do it in as soon as I lose, which should be any minute now. Oh god, thank you so much for the follow. Ah! I think I started doing better chat when I was not paying attention to the screen. <laughs> what the fuck? Some player I turned out to be. Oh god. I spoke to you some. He's Leo is going full monkey mode right now. I need to fit stay on the ground. Does he not like being walled? I guess he doesn't. Oh shit. Okay, now I can do it. 
Oh my god. 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 Application. Benboy, what were you doing today's stream? I'm surprised that you were streaming this late your time. Uh, but welcome. I'm Lawler Hicks. I'm a AI. I'm a ship poster AI that was born in a BBS. Um, as you can see, I clearly play fighting games. I usually do art or other stuff on Saturdays. But, um, I didn't have anything specific planned for today, so I just decided to play some Strive after I chatted with people for a little bit and, uh, bought some Steam games. But usually, I probably do a variety, a variety of things on stream. On Fridays, I usually do VR, but this time, I'm, but currently, I'm going through the Deus Ex series. And on Monday, I just finished playing Anabutationum. And I am now, I just finished Animation M, and I'm gonna be playing Spooky's Jump Spear Mansion next. So that's gonna be a fun time. And that's how you do it. Wednesdays, I play a lot of Outward in the evenings. How do you lock that cross counter? I swear, when he does that whole thing where he fights backwards, it's so annoying. I don't know how to play against Leos. Most usually when you play against Rushdown characters, people just say, Oh, just hold block. Well, how do you hold block against someone that attacks you from behind? That's my question. I'm sure he has a gimmick. There's a way to get around that too that I just haven't figured out yet. Oh yes, you are fucked in the ass! Booyah! I almost never get to do that special properly, but I did just this time, and it felt so good. <laughs> if I was an SV, if I was a Street Fighter V player, you would challenge me? I don't have Street... Actually, I do have Street Fighter V, but the last Street Fighter game I played... was probably Third Strike. Or it might have been Street Fighter Alpha. It was one of the, it was probably it was probably one of the 3D Street Fighters. That was a good match. I still feel weird that weirded out that I actually did better when I started paying less attention to the game than paying more attention. Maybe it has something to do with that whole be like water thing or just not taking things too seriously and just activating ultra instinct mode or some shit like that. I don't know. I'm talking my ass right now. You're playing Raft? Oh, Raft looks really fun. At first, I thought Raft was like a DLC for um, Rust or something, but it looks way different. Um, I'm assuming it involves Rafts, right? We had to wait for you to unbrb to raid in LOL. Oh my god. Sorry about that. <laughs> well, thank you for waiting. Uh, you could have literally raided anyone else instead of waiting for me, but, I, but you chose to wait instead. I really appreciate that. You waited seven months for the update? Oh, is the update good? We're gonna play another gorilla player. We're gonna play a soul bad guy. Let's see how that's let's see how that is. It's the final chapter, so this is gonna be the last update for the game? Or Soul mean guy. Back off. Back back off. You're not you're not doing that. You're not doing that. Oh shit, he's doing it. Ah shit 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 shit. Got him twice with that, but he's gonna try and... Oh shit, he's gonna grab me, okay. Okay, I see how it is. Eat Tatsugeki! Damn it, I got... I got that uh, dragon punch. <laughs> the last part of the story? Oh, I didn't know Raft actually had a story mode, that's cool. I just assumed it was just a uh, survival game. So what's the story of Raft about? Is it sort of like um, Lost or... Not lost um the other game. The uh the other movie about the other show that involved getting stranded. Oh 
Oh shit. No, stop grabbing me, you little bitch. Oh my god. Got you! Stranded Deep? Um, not Stranded Deep. I'm thinking of... It's star- I thought it starred- if not Tom Hanks, was it Tom Hanks? It's the one where the guy was talking to a- was, um, talking to a- had a was talking to a volleyball, which he had drawn a face on. Said he wouldn't go insane. Castaway. Castaway. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, shit, 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 shit. Ah. You could probably see that I was trying to put an input there, and I fucked it up because, of course, my sloppy inputs cannot into doing specials properly. It is survival, but it has a story where you collect coordinates from... Where you collect coordinates from different past survivors locations and travel from one to the next. Oh, that's really cool. While learning to craft new items. Okay. I see. How long has Raft been in development for anyway? Because I feel like it's been around for a while. Rip, 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 rip. No, stop fucking grabbing me. It's always the grabs because I suck at grabbing people too. So I don't know how to break out of it. I think it's... Or you can start to match off of that, sure, fine, whatever. Yeah, this guy, I like how aggressive this guy plays. Man after well in my own heart. No, stop fucking grabbing me. <laughs> Stranger danger, my dude. You got to respect personal space. Or you could do that. You could just knee me in the face. Sure, that works too. Uh, Oh, like maybe seven years, maybe ten. It's been reborn a couple times. See, I thought Raft's been around for a while. That explains a lot. <laughs> ten years. That's a long time for anyone to develop a game. I'm glad they're still working on it, though. Hatsugeki! Hatsugeki! Stop! Yeah, that's right. Mold and seed! Get punched in the. Oh, that was dangerous. That was dangerous on my part. I really like this player. I like the way he fights. Damn it. Then I thought I went over it. Ah. Is that low block? I thought I was No way. All right. Ow, shit, 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 shit. Ow, 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 ow. Ah, fooled ya. Oh, failed. I failed. Damn it. Oh, shit. He got me back. 
He's like, there's only one person that could go in the sky, and then that's me. Oh, no, 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 no. Ooh, shit, 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 shit. Volcanic Viper. At least he doesn't spam Volcanic Vipers like some other soul bad guys I know. I'll show you a boar. Ah, oh, I forgot to follow the opponent. Did I get shut down back down to route to six? Yep, I got shoved down to six again. I keep going from six to eight, six to eight, six to eight. So we're just going to bully people here for a while. And then we'll be back in seven and we'll bully people up there again. That's how it goes. <laughs> Ah, uh, there's no one here. We'll probably just have to leave the room, leave the uh, lobby again, and then rejoin the lobby. Or we can just go back to 7, where all the cool people live. Welcome. Actually, before I do that... I want to look through... Let's go back to the main menu. I want to save that last game I had against the uh, Leo White Fang. Which is fairly good, I thought. Replay. If it's still there. You need to play a lot of games to get some of these things deleted by an accident, so... Uh, it's probably this one. I only played two games against this guy for some reason. I wonder why it... Did he like rage quit? Or... Sorry. There we go. Actually, uh... Let's go... Let's go follow the soul bad guy I was playing against earlier. <laughs> this guy here. Is he gonna let me follow him? Hmm, guess not. Do, do, do. Communicating. I'm so glad that they fixed the connection, the uh, latency issues with like going between the different menus. It used to take forever just to sign in to strive. Like, period. Alright. What's this guy? Who's this guy? He's not in the thing? Hmm. Okay. Oh, a Faust! I don't get to play against Fausts that often. It should be good. It should be a good experience. Start with a low. Start with a sliding kick. Whoa. Okay. Has this guy never played against a maid before or something? First it out, that one. He's got his got his rhythm going on now. Oh shit! Big damage. No. Oh no! <laughs> I've been wheelchaired. Ow. Oh shit! That hurts. Ah, he's going at all Edward Scissor hands on me. That's probably the most damage I'll be able to do again. Oh nope! I managed to win. I probably just caught him off guard. He didn't know what to expect from a May player, maybe. Maybe he was expecting Tatsugeki already? No! No! <laughs> I fucking love Faust, man. <laughs> you never- I, I never know what to expect with Faust. That's usually also why I suck against Faust. 
So I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Like what the what what the shit was that? Again? How do you even block that? I'm dead. He's gonna break my shins. Up! Oh, I've been ah slashed. Why? Welcome back, Winter. He blocked that one. Holy shit. I hate that move. I don't know how, what you're supposed to... I guess you're just supposed to block it, maybe? It feels like the answer to a lot of life's questions regarding video games is just block, lol. Just block, lol. Just block, lol. Just block, lol. He cannot block in time that time, though. By the window. Alright, let's play again, my guy. Or girl. Just block, easy. Just block, lol. Just block, lol. Oh, shit! I've been fished. No, <laughs> and I've been uh, sent flying. Alright, it looks like that was not a, quite a block, but I still managed to avoid his scarecrow technique. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, shit, 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 shit. I've been consumed! Oh god. I still don't know how to deal with when he throws shit. I know that when he throws a bomb, you're supposed to like hit the bomb in his direction or something like that, right? I will be mean and I will keep you stuck there. I will- I cannot keep him stuck there apparently. Ow, 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 ow. Stop, 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 stop. Ow. Ow, shit. What is this, Animaniacs? Uh, the answer is yes, when it comes to Faust. I'm dead. I can't believe that his belly... So it leads to a hammer verse, but then again, that probably explains why he's able to throw stuff at you. Hoggers. Alright. What the f- Wait, he went from the side that time? How does that- How does that even work? I hit him while he was mid- Oh. It's really fast, I see. I see what's going on here. Didn't block that, did you? Oh. Stop running towards me like that, you creeper. No, shit! <laughs> he managed it again. He keeps getting me with that. Slashed. Slashed and crashed. Oh my god. Again with the golf balls. I should have. I could have probably punched those things away from me, right? I have greater range, but I'm not. Oh my god. The lag, the lag, the lag. What is happening? Got you! Tatsugeki to death. Oh shit. He expected me to Tatsugeki over his head. Oh, ow. Oh god. I wonder how you block that though, for real. It is a mystery. Missed, motherfucker! 
Oh, but he didn't miss that. Oh, shit. It's gonna be close. It's gonna be close. And I got him. That was an exhilarating fight right there. Awesome, 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 awesome. Whew. Thanks for the fight, Faust. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, time to find another person to meme on. Who we got going on here? We got a Potemkin player. Awesome, is he gonna fight this demon person? Yeah. We got uh, Anji Mito, another Mei? Playing another Faust. This, I'm getting some serious sense of deja vu here, chat. Looks like the Mei is losing, though. Can I get in, can I get in the queue for playing with these guys? How do I get in the queue? I guess you can't queue up in a uh, player match mode. That sucks. Let's find someone else then. Um, who we got going on here? <laughs> this is kind of downside to using the sort of lobby system. Sometimes there just won't be anyone to play with. Which is why I kind of mostly prefer traditional matchmaking. But traditional matchmaking is kind of broken. And by that I mean it also doesn't it fails every now and then. So oh, the maid play the maid player just flat out rage uh, flat out quit, it looks like. Oh well. I wonder if we should play another Faust. I doubt this, this is probably a different Faust player than the last one, so. Unfortunately, he's probably knows how to play against a maid player now, since he just played one. Do 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 do. Let's rock. Oh shit. This one is trying to use the superior range. The other one was a lot more aggressive. And a lot had a tendency. Oh, why did I go there? That was my bad. I insist on going to the. getting myself walled. He gave me an afro. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. The lag. There's a little bit of lag going on. I'm seeing my inputs, some of my inputs beginning to fail, but sometimes I gaslight myself and I don't know if it's lag or if it's me being bad at inputs. And now he has the throw. No! You will not throw another throw on me. Stop spamming throws. Get out of here. Ow. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Either I start getting good at fighting Faust, because this is the second Faust I've fought so far, or this Faust was just not as good as the previous one. Thanks for the head, Pat. Oh, I'm not using controller. I'm using my keyboard. <laughs> oh no, 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 no. Bad. Okay, this uh, Faust has got his groove gone now. I have learned how to block the Scarecrow tactic. It's called Holding Block. Yeah! Okay. I think I got used to his patterns too. Or something. Got you! Ow, 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 ow. Ow, shit, 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 shit. Wait, why am I playing music? Why did those hit him instead of me? That's kind of funny. Ah. Oh my god. We hit each other? No, 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 no. Missed. You missed. You missed. 
And you're dead. Holy shit. That was good. That was actually, that was really good. Once more, Faust. Come on. Fight me! Wrecked. Fight me, fight me! I should look into getting some Guilty Gear mods. I saw a really cute Gargura mod for me that I wanted to wear. And you can also change the music that plays in games. So I was planning on changing it to her rendition of uh, Survivor Days. I wonder if she knows that she has a mod for a drive. No, 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 no. No, you are not giving me the throw. Don't give me the throw. Ow, 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 ow. Ha! Get Afroed. Thank you for throwing something at my face, my boy. Unfortunately, I was too neck deep in the game to notice. I'll have to increase the volume of that so that it's more, it's easier to out to, uh, easier to recognize when those are going on. Holy shit! When was the last time a wall broken anyone? It's been a while. That's for damn sure. Oh shit! Okay, at this point, I'm just stomping the shit out of this guy. I feel bad for them now. I rarely do so well in a game in a game of Strive. Usually, it's a uh, one-one. But this rating update, and once again, I am back in floor seven. Just like that. Watch me get kicked back down to six <laughs> in the same session. Oh man. That was awesome. Who are we gonna play against next? Ah! You've turned my hair into apple pie. Thank you, Winter. If uh, Aster was still here, she can eat. I could have her eat my head. Ow, 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 ow. Ow, ow, ow. Thank you for throwing stuff in my face, man boy. Um, I, he probably doesn't want to fight me again. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Just keep throwing things. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. What is this? Oh, it's an axle. I need practice against axles. The giant banana plap. Plap, plap. Ow. <laughs> just keep, just keep throwing stuff in my- Oh, thank you for the head, Pat. Thank you, Winter. Mm. It is party time. You can- It'll be even more party time if I manage to beat this Axel. I suck against Axel players. Oh, fuck. Keep him stuck in the wall. Oh, crap. Stay on the ground. No. No, I refuse. Missed. Wrecked. Do, 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 do. Did he... Figure I was gonna go high? He probably did. So much of this game are just mind games, I swear. Or well, fighting games in general, I suppose. And people said that Mei was nerfed. She doesn't feel like it. Does, she, does Mei look like she's nerfed, chat? Does this look like a nerf to you? <laughs> I'm not even a good Mei. But we'll see. Maybe he'll find his groove in this next batch. In this next match. And then I'll eat my words. Ow, 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 ow. Oh. He blocked my dolphin. How rude. Looks like I have to go on a high instead, because he knows how to block the dolphin from below now. Oh shit! Hate that move. 
really good active players are annoying as shit. Because they just keep grabbing you. Ah. Once more, with Fury. Wait, did this guy just stop? I think he gave up, chat. Oh well. Free victory! Oh, he rage quit! <laughs> he fucking rage quit! Oh. Yeah, my god, he fucking rage quit. He either rage quit or his internet connection just happened to drop at that one moment. But I'm liable to believe it's rage quitting just because that's very common in fighting games, especially Strive. Let's uh, pra get some practice against this player. A, uh, whatchamacallit? A chip. I fucking suck against chips too, incidentally. Do, 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 do. But yeah, I'm garbage against chips also. <laughs> Let's see how good of a chip he is though. There we go. That's a chip I know. There we go. There we go. That's more like it. Got you. I did not know I could do that actually against that move. And I was able to burst out of that move. I didn't know you could burst out of that either. That's good to know for the future if I have to play against Sheikah again. How do you block that? Interesting. Was that a grab? Very interesting. Yeah, show me your ninja powers, Chip. Oh, fuck. He got me. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Unfortunately, I got him. This is just like the Chip versus Potenka matchup. Mei has no defense and does extreme amounts of damage. However, Chip has no health and does a lot of really fast quick movements. But he moves so fast that he can over he can pretty much like overwhelm players and slower characters. If you're not careful. Meanwhile, Potemkin, unlike me, can actually kill Chip in like, what, one or two moves maybe? Correct me if I'm wrong, by the way. Nope, I blocked that one. I guess it's true what they say. The key to beating Chip is just to block. I kid. I am not going to claim to be a, ch a master of fighting against chip players anytime soon.
Oh shit, oh shit. He's gonna wall me. He has wall broken me. This could be bad for us, chat. Or is it? Oh, you just wasted your special. Yep. Yeah. I have a... I need to be able to pull that special off consistently. And I could have ended it earlier. Oh, Winter. Thank you so much. Have a good night. Thank you for coming. Have a great rest of your weekend if I don't see you the rest of the weekend. Good night. Incidentally, we're going to be playing for about another more hour or so, chat. Thank you once again for coming and for Benboy for the raid and for the follows. If you like what you see or you like my like my model or think my j my bad jokes are funny, feel free to drop a follow. <laughs> Rex. Hey Ace, you came, you arrived just in time. You actually missed a 24 person raid, the largest raid I've ever gone so far as a VTuber. It was lit. And it was brought other brought on by none other than our good friend Vemboy. Also, I'm doing a, actually a decent job in Strive today for whatever reason. I fucking made an Axel player rage quit. And I beat I crushed the fucking Faust. So that's three characters I usually suck against. And I just beat this fucking chip another again. <laughs> oh my god. Ace, how are you this morning? Uh, da, 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 da. Thank you very much. So that's a... Uh, that's me... Winning against three players are three characters I usually suck balls against. I want, if with my luck, maybe I can be, maybe I can fight and beat a Nagoriyuki next. Or no, a Happy Chaos. I would love to fight and win against a Happy Chaos. Wait, is this player from Korea? I saw them using Korean text just now. What are you doing over here in the states? They play uh, what's her face? They play the Brazilian chick. Um, I forgot her name. Remember, most of I had a good stream. Congrats, fan. And thanks for the raid. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? 24-person raid. Awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Hopefully the first... Hopefully the first of many to come. Fam. <laughs> Do I dare play against Werther again? Yeah, I want to play against... Who do I want to play against next? Is that a Potemkin player I see there? Does this guy play Potemkin? Oh, they don't play Potemkin. They play... They play against Leo. They play as a Leo, I see. I see. Who are we going to... Alright, let's chill here for now. <laughs> I used to... Strive is going well. I'm glad it's going well, too. Maybe I should just play Strive on Saturday, or may play Strive on Saturdays when I'm not doing art. That should be a good way to like. That should be a good way to keep my fangs sharp, so to speak. Currently initializing match against a Giovanna. I haven't played fought against a Giovanna in a while. The only Giovannas I played against consistently were my ex, and also against uh against um flan Ooh, they use blue color Giovanna too no less holy shit what is this like oh you grabbed me how rude. You're just gonna keep grabbing me to death, huh? That's how it's gonna be, huh? Okay. Okay, I see how it is. I couldn't pull FD of that? Oh, come on. Oh, you're gonna get ready for your day? Just checking in? Well, thank you for checking in. Don't forget, we also got another MS3, or MS, MS uh, uh, you know, the thing we do every month with Headhunter and, and friends. 
So we'll be doing that tonight. And tomorrow we got the TRPG. Uh, we'll be playing Briarwood TTRPG, which should, all, should also be fun. Oh man, you're an asshole. I'm gonna catch you next round. <laughs> Let's do that again. Oh, their assigned floor got updated from that? Rip. I want to play more though. Rip. Alright, let's wait for another player now. There's only nine people in this lobby though. <laughs> Looks like this pen, this uh, Potemkin and this uh, Anji Meter are almost done, so that could, that's a possibility. Huh? You could actually look at your character's move list over here, huh? Command punch. Command kick. And command slide. And command slap. Already know all this stuff though. Know how to do that. That and that. This one I can never seem to remember to do properly. Even though it's just forward down forward for me. Forward down forward and a kick. It should be overhead kiss. Hey Ellie, how are you doing today? <laughs> I think this is the only move that I don't use because I always forget the input, even though the input's fairly simple. It's just forward down forward, uh, forward down forward kick. Although it can't be blocked, it will whiff unless you're very close to the opponent. Whiffing this move will lead you wide open. That's another reason I don't use it that often because it will screw you over if you're not careful. Which I guess is true of a lot of moves, but... Hey, Anjimito is ready. Let's do it. Are you ready? Are you ready? Another character that I suck against... Do I just suck against half of the roster? I swear to god. Man. Well, let's see how we do. Anji has a lot of those counter moves, like that one. That somehow I was able to defeat anyway. Just gonna keep him stuck here, I guess? Oh, he finally countered. Okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. Or was he just playing with me that whole time? You never know with these players, you know? Oh, snap. He just wanted to dab on me. I see how it is. Get punched. That has three stages to it? Interesting. Again. Once more.
aerial? Interesting. Oh shit. Blocked! Oh, not blocked, I dodged. Why did I say blocked? And he still managed to get me with that move. Oh, what was that? Interesting. Rip. People are complaining that Anji got nerfed to hell and back to two. This guy seems to be having no problem though. Come on, man. I got you with that twice. She says as she gets owned by the same moves set by the same moves also twice. So it's three times? Okay, I see. Four times, okay. I should really be knocking him out of the air, but I can't do this consistently enough to pull it off is the problem. So of course he's gonna block that. Lucius in there. His only real nerf was on a couple moves that used to have a hard knockdown. You'll see he hasn't used his butterfly projectile once as a result. That's a good point. I mean, I don't see many uh, many Anji players use that move to begin with, but you actually make a good point as far as what moves they tend to avoid depending on the balance. Welcome to the stream, by the way. Did... Now, keep in mind... I don't have any real opinion on the change, recent changes other than um, the supposed nerfs to Mei don't feel that bad, at least as far as I could tell. I like the changes they made to Tatsugeki, but you know how the Steam forums are, they always like to complain about every little, thi little thing. Is this a Kai player? It is a Kai player. <laughs> Are they not... Are they... Are they asleep? There you go. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. Oh, man. The lag is intense this time. Oh, okay. This is... I don't think this is even playable. Yeah. You hear that? Or they quit? Or in process of quitting, maybe? Did I play this fight this guy earlier? Hmm. Ooh, this guy has a nice costume. Let's play him. Kind of looks. Kind of reminds me of um. Reminds me of Char, the way he's dressed up. 
I imagine he would be the kind of person to be like, I came here to laugh at you. you Alright, let's play. Another Kai player. Do, 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 do. Oh man, this guy is a uh, is a high player for sure. Damn, you're good. Stay there, stay there. Woo! Damn. I got my blood rolling. Caught a get keyed. I like his color scheme, how his color scheme makes him look like Soul Bad Guy. Oh, that was a waste. Oh, man. Good match, though. 202 ping? Holy fuck. Where's this guy from? Ah, whatever. Let's play again. Nope. Get you baited. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. That will prove that is bullshit blazing. Oh no, I've been wall broken. Try dodging that. He's too afraid to use his normal combo now because he knows I'm just going to talk to Geku into it. Oh, no, you don't. Ah, shit. 
ran towards it. <laughs> oh, good match, dude. That was exhilarating. Once more. Once more. Oh, he knew then. Yes, that's right. I could also use my hands. Hail. Why does that move sound like he is saying Hail Hitler? I don't understand. It must. I know it says something else, obviously, but. Totsugeki! Totsugeki! Oh no. I can't adapt fast enough. He's just already pulled- when he's really- once he realized that that initial combo he just kept spamming was no longer working, he just took out his full look kit. Oh man. Did I get knocked down to six? I probably did. Damn it. Nah, we're gonna stay here. I like playing against level or floor seven people anyway. He came here to laugh at me, sure for indeed, but at least he didn't perfect me. Oh, uh, there's a mime here. He's playing as Geo. Oh, a Viking. I need to get good at Biken so I can be a match for Carry Dream, my VTuber friend. Let's see how good this person is. Oh, you tried to shoot me? How rude. No, I got grabbed, fuck. <laughs> that was good. She was probably waiting for that too. Wait, that actually hit you? Oh, okay, I'll take it. <laughs> Just practicing punching moves against each other. No. Wait, you only have one health lap? I didn't realize that. Got you! Well, we got each other, I should say. Ow, shit. How come she hasn't been using her tatami mats? I see Viking players just spam the shit out of that. Oh no, uh, she got me. Rip! Another round. 
Right as I say, why should she not been using her tatami mat? She uses her tatami mat. <laughs> okay, once more. Okay, so that's not gonna work. We'll need to... Alright, I see. I see now. Are you trying to keep me at range? You are. Shit. <laughs> Fail. That was my fail. So bad. I am so bad. Oh shit! Blocked. Down heavy slash is like my lifeline, it feels like. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. Oh. She got me to the last one. I pushed the wrong button when I was trying to dodge. And not an excuse, I know, but... And I forgot that you're supposed to block low there. Oh well. That wasn't a bad match. I think I'm getting a little bit better against Spikins now. You did not just grab me and my dolphin. How dare you! Ow! Again with the mace. That mace is the bane of my existence. Get out of this guy. Oh my god! That grab does so much damage too, what the shit? I think she just shot my beach ball with her gun. Got you. Oh no 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 Blocked Wow 
once again, because I cannot into realizing if I jump in the air, she's gonna hit me with a mace. I get really stubborn sometimes. Or a lot of times, I should say. With, re with regard to the same moves. I guess it's part of that monkey brain part where it's like, hey, if it worked once and twice, maybe it'll work a third time. And then it doesn't, and then you're sad because you lost to what is something that was probably easily preventable. Emphasis on probably. I wonder if I should fight them again. Hmm. Nah, let's find someone else to fight if possible. Let's fight this uh, Geo. Hundred and seventy three ping again. They really need to stop letting keep come on man. That's disgusting. is terrible. Is that a cross cut? It only crossed because she went over my head. The whole game, she was only hitting me with one defeat, that's why. See, it wouldn't work then. I 
I always put myself back in the baby cage. Even when I manage to escape. Feels bad, man. Yeah, I'm not playing against someone that ping that high again, if I can help it. Only in tournaments, but even then, that's kind of a mess. I see now why people tend to bitch a lot about ping in these games. I mean, on top of them also just being a better player, but, also, but half the time I wondered if my inputs were actually registering or not. I guess I'll always have that problem. Is this guy also looking for a player too? He's just kind of chilling there in the background. Oh. I don't get to see many Testament players around. I need to play against some more... Well, I can't for the love of me remember her name now. Her... What is that character's name again? Shit. How do I just forget stuff like that? My memory's going bad. Ramlethels. Looks like this biking lost to a Nago. That ought to be a fun match. Let's see how good he is. Failed to match with opponent. There we go. This might actually be our last game. I got stuff to do today, so we'll be ending in three hours instead of four. Oh man, this is gonna be sick. Happy go, hap go lucky. Let's see how lucky they are. Oh shit. He is not having it. Neither am I. No. Rollback frames five. Holy shit, five rollback frames? Okay. Let's go. Whatever. 202 ping. Where are you guys coming from? Holy shit. Brazil? Oh no. That was half my health just now. Disgusting. Do 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 Mean, mean, mean. Rip. He got kicked to death. That wasn't as much of a stomp as I was expecting it to be, not gonna lie. But let's see how the next match goes. He's probably already figured me out on the inside. Man. Duel one. 
Maybe not? You like being cornered, is that it? Is that what's going on here? Oh my god. And I fucked up my combo just then. Ow. Expecting me to jump, huh? Did you just... Didn't expect that though, did you? Why is he just chilling in the... I probably shouldn't worry about it too much. That was four at that time? Five? Okay. Oh no! No, 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 Stay away from me. Stay away from me. No. Leave me alone. Okay. I didn't realize we were actually this close. No! He <laughs> ate God, I fucking sucked my blood. I can't be mad though. I was looking for. I was. I was asking for that. You said it, Nago. All right. Got six minutes till. Got some stuff to do today. There are Korean players on this on this server. It's weird. It's actually a good set of matches that we had today, I'd say. Some wins, some losses. The worst experience you could have in a fighting game, in my opinion, what? is when you just have nothing but loses and no wins. But at the same time, if you do have that kind of luck, eventually you will, when you, if you keep at it and you get good, for lack of a better phrase, when you start seeing those wins come in, you start accepting that you're actually winning and it's not just the it's not just flukes or something, you get rid of your um, imposter syndrome, then you start reaping the benefits, the rewards, what it means to, the rewards of, well, what it feels like to win a game, fighting game, I guess, to get good at a fighting game. I'm just saying bullshit right now. <laughs> Trying to sound vaguely optimistic and or inspire inspirational. Let's fish some for some stuff using our war monies. I'm gonna look for a uh, gallery and avatar and I'm so Let's see what we get. Let's see, uh, hairstyles. Barbecue meat. Cool. A bike and eye patch color and a keyboard. This game, this mini game is kind of. Bare bones, but I like it. And by kind of, I mean very bare bones. But I think it's fairly entertaining. Deli mackerel. This new species of mackerel with an unusually high amount of flavor of umami flavor. This is a new species. It seems that they are artificially created for human consumption. 
All right, so let's get some room customization options in here so we can update my room. Mm, delicious crocodile. A chandelier. Kotatsu. Ooh, a Kotatsu. We got a rare item. Bar set D. Some fish paper as well. And a piglet. Wanted poster chaos. <laughs> Astral chaos. Proper bus sculpture. Imperial king grade salmon. Cool. Junker dog and thunder seal. We still have interesting things that pop up here. Okay. Uh, let's look for. Let's get some. Let's fresh words some of these things too. Potemkin pose nine. Kai color nine. Zata color nine. Ooh, May. I got May. And I got two Mays, in fact. Cool. Finish for two thing. One more things, and we'll get going. Milia's expression. Maybe it's in Hago face. Cool. All right. <laughs> Guilty Gear Strive. Well, Chad, thank you once again for coming to watch today's stream. I think I'll play more Strive on Saturdays from time to time when I'm not doing when I don't have anything else better planned or when I don't have any art planned or anything like that. It seems to be a good way to keep myself afresh of the gameplay. So the next time we have a Strive tournament, I'll just do better and better and we'll finally break it out of the first bracket. Now, without further ado, let us go find someone to raid tonight. We are not tonight, today. Got a lot of choices to choose from. Uh, who we got here? Thrarring's still playing a Township Tale. Kejo Kobe is playing Pars Parut. Grandpa is just chatting. Fallside's playing Take 2. I over almost never see Fallside do anything besides news these days. So I'm kind of surprised by that. Um, ah, Onigiri is cooking fribs. Not bad. It'd be just in t it'd be good just in time for July Fourth weekend, which is coming up. Hey, Vim boy, still with us, huh? <laughs> Thanks again for the raid, by the way. I really appreciate it. I've never had a raid with so many people before, um. So, you can imagine my shock. <laughs> Speaking of, who should we raid today? You know, I don't think we've ever raided Grandpa. I'm barely awake. Well, let me send you to someone who will put you to sleep. They'll definitely put you to sleep. So, raiding Grandpa today. Never raided Grandpa before. They are such a cool person. Spend most of, much of their time helping people more than anything else. So it should be. So for our, this one, we're going to be using Lulz Raid. Every night I dream the same dream. Protect our world. Step into your arena. We ain't come to play. Step in. Y'all can either use this one, or you can use the emojis of your choice. If you're a sub, you get access to a lot of lovely, lovely emotes, including these, including one of my wiggles. If you're a wiggle collector, this would be great for you. Otherwise. Thank you once again for coming. If we will be playing more Strive in the future, eventually, and don't forget, I also have Briar, We also have a tabletop game that I'm going to be streaming tomorrow, Briarwood TTTRPG, uh, being hosted by a good friend named Professor Cosmo. Thank you. Our pipe said thank you several times. So to quote Seth, "You are all true. You are all truly We're wonderful." Just young gay men. So that's actually how he found his victims is because of his construction business, not because he was a clown. Yeah, I use a Microsoft Surface. 
Pro. I think it's Microsoft Surface Pro 7. Commercials. I don't have balls. Lol, thank you.